Princess was ending a visit to a sheltered housing and workshop project at Cramlington in Northumberland. The man suddenly burst from the crowd towards her, but was quickly overcome by detectives. The Princess simply carried on, seemingly unconcerned about what had happened. But amateur video shot by someone in the crowd appears to show the man did actually reach her. She fell back and the policeman was there. The, you know, the plainclothes guy. He was straight there. And there was a gun, sort of, you know, visible in his coat. Inspector Alan Peters is the princess's personal bodyguard. He's accompanied her and Prince Charles on countless royal tours. In January, the Queen made him a member of the Royal Victorian Order. The incident highlights the danger faced by members of the royal family carrying out official engagements. A pro-IRA demonstrator tried to get to the Duchess of York during her visit to America last year. But today, police denied there'd been a major breach of security. The man was detained by security officers. He's been taken to a local police station where he's been questioned and it's too soon to say uh, what action will be taken against him, if any. The man was later named as Edward Adcock. Last year, he hit the headlines by trying to embrace Olympic sprinter Flo Joe Griffith Joyner. Tonight, after being released on bail, he apologised for the trouble he'd caused. I've always admired her, he said, was in the process of giving her a hug, but I didn't realise it would finish up this way.